Okay, hello everyone. Welcome to our Wednesday live at five-ish at Old Town Quilt Shop in Orchid, California. I am Stacy. Um, just want to give any newcomers our information. So address, phone number, no, the phone is on the other side. Hours of operation. <laughs> and we're going to flip this around, give you the rest of our information. So if you need to contact us, you can find us on the web, you can email us, or you can give us a call. Alrighty, so that's that info. If you're watching us live on Facebook, then obviously you already, hopefully you already like us on Facebook, but you can like us on Facebook as well as on Instagram and even TikTok. <laughs> Although I'm not very good posting on TikTok. I'm not up on all these. I know, you're young, you should be. No, I'm old. <laughs> I just don't have time. I'm not old, but I don't have time. All right, so I guess if we have some people on, um, we can go ahead and start with the fabric and then we'll make any announcements at the end. Okay, so we got some fabric in today and some pre-cuts. Well, not today, this week. Um, so one of them is called Hue and they are little dragonflies. Um, these are white on whites. These are 11.45 a yard from Timeless Treasures. So hopefully you can see it in the video. Um, there's kind of like two different sizes of the dragonflies in here, kind of a smallish one and then a larger one. We have previously gotten a white on white with dragonflies that were all the same size and they were all smaller than these small ones, more scattered. So this one's a little bit different. And this is a fairly true white, maybe leaning a little on the ivory side, but not, not quite. So it's a good white on white. So just type in hue and then the, you know, click on the dragonflies one and it'll be there. Otherwise it's in all the new stuff as all of this will be. Okay, continuing with the white on whites and these ones are much harder to see. And I don't know how they're gonna come out on here. They didn't come out very good on my camera, on my picture. Um, these are ramblings uh, from P&B and they're $10.99 a yard. This first one here has little squares on it and we have had this one before. Um, it's a pretty popular one. If you just want something that's not stark white, you know, just a plain white, these are really good for that. So this is squares, um, kind of filled in ones and then, you know, the little open ones in there as well. And then the other one that we got is circles. They're dots that make up circles. Yeah. And this one's really hard to see. It was yeah. really hard to get a picture. I swear there's circles on there. <laughs> so that's what those are. And those are called ramblings from P&B. Okay, if you wanna know what the circles look like, they kinda look like this on the white and white. <laughs> They're open circles made of dots, uh, but much, much smaller. So this one is called Fresh Cut. I believe it goes with a line of, I don't know, florals, but we really like, mom really likes black and whites. <laughs> and she likes to get the opposites of each other. So we have the white background with the black dots on it. And then we have the black background with the white dots on it. Um, again, these are called Fresh Cut from P&B and they're 1380 a yard. And this white really is a white, white. You can kind of see it up next to the ramblings. The ramblings is much, you know, creamier and then the fresh cut is a more white, true white background. So that's those. Those would be cool. This would make a cool border or even sashing if you want just a little pop of something. You want, you know, not just straight black, but you want more than just a tone on tone black. And then the white could be a cool background um, depending on what you're doing. So those are kind of neat. And PNB, we haven't had a lot from PNB lately, um, but they are, you know, a good company. We've had, like I said, we've had that that square one before. So, okay. Next is Susie B. These are all thirteen forty-five a yard, and they're from Clothworks. So you might recognize the bees. We've had those before. Um, super popular bees have been really popular lately. Um, so those are a returning fabric, and then the green gingham. Um, this is a nice size gingham. It's, you know, really small. You can see on my fingernail here that they're pretty tiny. I think they're considered like eighth inch. Um, we have the same gingham from Susie B in yellow currently. And if you're doing the giraffes pattern, these are really cute for that. <laughs> and then we also have the 
uh, swirls, and these are a tone on tone, so it's a light aqua with a little bit darker aqua um, swirl on there. So that would make a good um, a blender to go with some other things. And the bees are just stinking cute. They have little happy faces on them. So that's all from Susie B. And if you just type Susie B, you'll find all of these um, in there, plus a couple of other ones. Susie B has really cute stuff. Okay, the next one is Laurel Birch, and this is a confetti, and we have the white version of this with the white background and then all the colored dots. Um, and so now we have the black. So I'm gonna kind of open this up a little bit so you can see that they're kind of like splotched. So it's like you took a spray paint and went and then it splattered everywhere um, with all the different colors. So you've got you know, red and pink and green and yellow and orange and purple and blue. So you've got all the different colors in there. So really this could pair with so many different things. If you've got a kid's quilt that you need some sashing for or you just need something fun to pop something else, these are great for that. And these are a Laura Birch and they're one of her basics. It's Confetti 2. Um, it is actually black. I know it doesn't look black in the camera. It looks more gray, but it really is a black, uh, you know, solid black background on there. Okay, that's it for actual yardage of fabric, but then we also got some pre-cuts. So from Island Batik, we have Calm Lagoon, and we have it in both the two and a half inch strip sets and the 10 inch squares. Both of these are $43.99. The two and a half inch strips have 40 pieces and the squares have 42 pieces in them. So they include duplicates. This is a nice collection of um, blues and greens. So if you're trying to do like an ocean type quilt or people just really like blues and greens, but you know, Calm Lagoon kind of gives it away that it's got ocean themes. So you can see here in this blue on the strips, there's starfish and you know different looks like a bunch of different shells in there we did order fabric for this but with island batik you get the pre-cuts and then like a month or two later you get the yardage so get your pre-cuts now save them and when we get the yardage then you can actually make your quilt and then the other ones that we got from them are Petals Provence. So this is your classic blue and yellow combination. It's a little bit darker blue than the blue and yellow that we had before. Um, you go into the really deep navy in this one. So again, we got the strips and the 10 inch squares. And can we just say how beautiful this is? Thank you so much, Island Batik. <laughs> we love how they package them because you can see every single piece in their 10 inch squares and they don't flop all over the place and get in our way. and look unattractive. So again, Petal Provence. Um, once again, we ordered fabric to go with it, but we'll see it in a while. November, maybe. Maybe December. Okay, and then we have Petal Power. This is from me and my sister designs for Moda. We do actually have the fabric on its way. I'm hoping it'll be here next week, um, but this is a really great collection. You know, it's got their classic the large flowers, all those pretty colors, the bright pinks and purples and greens, orange. So if you're looking to do a fun girls quilt, um, this is gonna be it. And we got a lot of coordinating fabrics to go with this. So you'll definitely be able to make something out of this and a really cool black, and, um, white on white. If you can see the little flowers there, similar to these. So it's a really cute, um, collection there and this is $11.99 for the five inch squares and we did only get the five inch squares but like I said we ordered uh, like 10 or 12 bolts to go with this collection and I'm hoping that it'll be here next week. You have the invoice so that's a good thing. <laughs> okay also from Moto we have a late comer for Christmas. <laughs> So this one is called Home Sweet Holidays, and this is a kit. So it starts with um, a panel. So it's got, you know, the Merry Christmas. It has um, a little mason jar with poinsettias in it, a birdhouse, a classic truck, and then a rocking chair with um, boots in front of it. So you cut that panel up, and then the rest of this is all pieced in there. So this kit includes everything that you need to make the top and the binding 
plus the pattern. Um, and this is $104.99. Again, this is Home Sweet Holidays Quilt Kit. It's a Deb Strain. There we go. Can you see it? Maybe, maybe. And the size of this is 50 by 66. I'll turn it around. Maybe you can see the back of it better. Maybe that will help. So it is a lot of piecing, so you could do it for next year. Um, but, you know, I've done one, not this particular one, but I did one last year. Um, and it's a lot of fun. It's a little, you know, it's a bunch of little pieces, but it's fun to put it all together. And if you just kind of take it maybe like row by row, um, it, you know, break it down, it makes it much easier. And they're just really cool. They're neat kits. You know, it comes with everything that you need. So could be a nice gift for someone as well. Otherwise, you can make it for 2022 Christmas. Or if you're super ambitious, you know, you can bust this out this year. I'd love to see you do it. <laughs> okay. The newest three-yard quilt book from Fabric Cafe. So this is called Quick and Easy. Um, I'll show you the back. Now what she's done is kind of redone these quilts. This was, all of these patterns are from her, like her very first book. Um, where she didn't include how to enlarge the quilts. So to give you the, you know, the twin size or the queen and king size. Um, so she's just kind of reimagined them, done them in different fabrics, um, done them a little bit different. Like this one was in the kids book, um, but I think it was nine patches in here instead of the pinwheels. So she's changed a, you know, a few things up. Um, we've done that Byzantine door before, you know, the spools we've seen, picture perfect we've done. So this is kind of bringing back some of her older designs that maybe um, you didn't get to see the first time around. So if you're a collector of the three yard quilt books like we are, you're definitely gonna wanna get this one. So again, this is quick and easy three yard quilts and the book retails at $15.99, but as always, we discount our books 30% off. So if you're doing it, um, if you're purchasing it online, um, in the code at the end when you check out, it's gonna ask for a coupon code or a gift certificate. You're gonna put the coupon code BOOK30, that's B-O-O-K-3-0, and that's no caps on that. Um, and if you come into the shop and purchase it, we automatically give the 30%. So that's that. And then we got these really cute little tomato wrist pin cushions, so they strap to your wrist so that you've got a little pin cushion there handy so you can just poke your pins in you grab them off and then you poke them in there try not to poke your wrist <laughs> see how successful that is um, but we've got two colors whoops whoops purple and blue so if you are ordering it online then please specify purple or blue if we still have it you'll get it otherwise you'll get what we have Okay, and these are $8.99 each. I wonder if the price probably fell off when I dropped it. And they were on back order forever. So we will get, you know, if we sell out of these, we'll get more. It's just, you know, if they're still on back order, then it'll take a little while. Okay, so we have a new project in the shop that we have finished. And I don't know if this is going to be better long ways or wide. Let's see. We'll try it this way, and if it doesn't work out, then I'll go the other way. Go the other way. All right. It's long. You can see. Just me. <laughs> I don't remember how long it is. Like 60 inches. Um, but it's only like 14 or 15 inches wide. So this is out of the book Big Block Runners, um, which I'll show you in a minute. But we did it out of fall fabrics and we, you know, of course we can't ever follow a pattern exactly how it is. So we combined some fabrics to, to uh, make it. But you can do this in fall, you can do this in Christmas, you can do this in birthday, you can do this in bright things. You know, it doesn't have to be, it doesn't have to be fall. Um, so this is the book it came out of, Big Block Runners. And this happens to be number four. They just number them, one, two, three, four, five, and six. So this one is number four. Um, so it shows you some of them there in the front and then here in the back. And it's this one that we did. So I'll give you a little bit different look on that. 
yeah, it's number four. So these books retail at $20, and again, we discount them um, 30%. So if you're doing it online, use the code BOOK30. If you purchase it here in the shop, then we do it automatically. We do have one kit available, one kit made right now. I can make more um, for this, and the kit retails at $27.99. It does not include the book, so you will have to purchase the book separately from uh, the kit if you wanna make it. But if you buy the book, You'll get all these other, you know, I mean, there's this cute little Christmas one down there. So there's all kinds of cute little runners in there. And they came together, this one came together really easily. Um, you know, nothing is super complicated in these. They're all pretty basic. Yeah, no special rulers needed. I know that makes you guys crazy when you need a special ruler for something. You know, of course, you could use the folded corner clipper on so many of these things. You could use the... Um, um, block lock ruler to square up your half square triangles you know there's all things that you could use but you don't have to you can just use your regular rulers for this one and they're all again it's big blocks so it's nothing you know there's no tiny piecing um, if this is too long for you you can always shorten it you can take off a block and just do three or just do two just do one if you just want a table topper maybe make placemats um, so that's that so it's called um, fall big block runner if you're looking for the kit in the shop otherwise big block runner book is the book okay so that's everything new that we've gotten in um, I want to give a shout out to our Dresden dude who did his class today they <laughs> had a great class so thank you to you guys for stepping up and teaching that um, we've got one more class uh, this month on the 23rd. It's Mimosa, and Mom is teaching that, so we have a few more spots in that. And then I think we're pretty much done as far as classes go for the rest of the year. We'll just wait until January. We've got a lot of um, things that we're kind of stacking up for the new year so that we can get you guys pumped for, for quilting. And hopefully some of you who are in our beginner class will be ready to tackle something new, and you know, in January we can get you guys going on that. Um, we do, however, have some open spots in December. We have open days where there's nobody in the classroom, like Tuesdays and Wednesdays. I think there might be a Thursday somewhere in there. So if you need to do like secret sewing, if you've got projects that you're doing for your whoever's living at home with you and they always bust into your sewing room so you can never work on it there, you can come here. You know, you can just reserve the room, come in, sew it here. That way you don't have to hide everything. Um, you can spread out and, you know, so we do have a few of those days. So if you kind of anticipate that you're going to need some days um, to do some secret sewing or just whip stuff out without distraction, then, you know, you can do that. And again, that's in December. I know it's a long ways away, but if you're just looking ahead to all those holiday projects that you should be working on, <laughs> then those are open. All righty. So any questions, comments? We good? All right. Well, everyone have a wonderful evening and we will see you next week. Good night.